Hello, good evening. Uh, my name is uh, Haris Rockman, and today I'm going to continue uh, with the topic symmetry. <clears throat> so, uh, symmetry and patterns. Symmetry is uh, essentially where an image can be divided in half um, and be visually similar or similarly weighted. Patterns refer to an element within the image that is repetitive, tones, colors, shape, lines, and forms, for example. Um, this is uh, defined by Gale Powers, <coughs> uh, 2018. So, uh, moving on. Okay, moving on. <coughs> Um, let's start uh, with the obvious. Symmetry in design uh, refers to the arrangement of the elements on a page that are equal to each other on both sides. Uh, you can think of a butterfly, a circle, a square, a triangle, or a rectangle. Uh, if you fold any of those forms down the center, uh, each side will be equal in size and shape to its op opposite side. This is referred to as uh, bilateral symmetry, which is the first types of uh, symmetry. Um, the face, the human face, as well as the rest of the human body, uh, is usually symmetrical as well. If you draw a line down the middle of a typical human face, you will find that if you were able to fold that image, uh, the eyes will line up as well as the ears. Both half of the nose and the mouth. Mm. There are other types of symmetry as well. You can observe symmetry in uh, an unexpected places. You can even find symmetry in circular design. Uh, radial symmetry is when an object is rotated around a circle in equidistant um, increments. In other words, when something is rotated around a circle to form a symmetrical design. Uh, the example shown uh, shows a square that has been rotated around a circle in 20 degrees increments. Uh, the result is a circular pattern that is symmetrical. Mm. And the last one would be translational symmetry. <clears throat> Translational symmetry doesn't mean that the object have to be all uh, in the same size. In the example shown below, uh, the squares move from uh, the background to the foreground and gets bigger as they get closer. Uh, this implies motion and movement. Um, yeah, thank you. So the last slide uh, shows a few examples of uh, bilateral uh, symmetry that are available uh, in this world. Thank you.